Hey guys, this is Matt Reacts, and today I'm gonna tell you a little story. Gonna break out of my genre real quick, but I know you guys won't mind. So today I'm going to be telling you about... Combos. Yeah, combos. You know that snack that was introduced in the 1980s? Those little snacks that were shaped like cylinders which had pretzels and a really weird cheese filling in between. You know, a lot of flavors came and went, but they're really underrated. And I have to tell you, as a food replacement, it really, really hits the spot. And they were also one of the first snack companies to start making sweet and salty snacks, as they already had the instated salty snacks. Uh, since the word combo is a mix of two things, they decided to do the sweet and salty mix. And I gotta tell you, uh, they sound pretty good, but I've never had them before, and I can't wait to have them. And about the flavors that came and went, there are about eight flavors still in rotation. Uh, at least that's what they say on the website. I say at least because a few months back I snacked on jalapeno combos all the time and I don't think they got rid of them just yet. But I may be wrong. I haven't been to the local Chevron food store since, but, uh, you know, um, I'm gonna be listing the seven flavors on the website. Well... Eight because of the cheddar cheese cracker and pretzel but you know uh, work on me with this because it's the same flavor let's keep going the remaining flavors are cheddar cheese cracker and pretzel pizzeria pretzel pepperoni cheese cracker buffalo blue cheese pretzel seven layer dip cracker sweet and salty caramel cream pretzel and sweet and salty vanilla frosting cream pretzel so those are the basic combos that are still in rotation now now I'm going to explain why they're so underrated. I'm not upset at anyone in particular, but come on. It's like finding El Dorado and only telling a small group of friends. It's like finding the Fountain of Youth, bottling its water, not selling it on the shelves of a market. That's the same deal with combos. I mean, every time I go to the store, I go into the snack aisle and find a pile of combos. Like, every time I go to the store to get them, I fear they will rise up like the Mount Kilimanjaro and fall down when I reach to get 7 layer dip, because the rest of the flavors are the more crappy ones. And at the corner store, that, I'll have to go check the price of the combos, because nobody buys them. So in short, I have to wait longer because there are no scanners and people are always buying Lay's. Nothing on you, Lay's. I love you, Lay's. The sponsor. The last reason gets me angrier than any other. Because of the piling over combos in the grocery store, they become stale. Not stale stale, but not fresh. And that really gets me mad. Because whenever I'm short on cash, I just get a small bag of Lay's. It's always fresh, because everyone buys them. Well, that is a good business strategy, though. Something to snack on when you're saving money. But, but it's still a stale stale situation <laughs> well anyway that's all i really have to say about combos please everyone you guys need to step up to the plate and try combos if you haven't please give it its props it really deserves or i'll buy all the potato chips and burn them in a bonfire camping in the woods with my three other partners just kidding but seriously try combos and combos if you're watching this video please sponsor me Alright guys, we're at the Chevron and I uh, found the sweet and salty. I guess this is a new little um, flavor that they came up here. Let's go ring it up. Yeah. Didn't see this one on the website. Thank you. Good deal, two ninety nine. All right, we're gonna take this back to the house and we're gonna try it. Hey guys, this is Matt Reacts and we're in the Chevron and I'm gonna open up these combos and take a taste for them for y'all. Hold on. Very nice. I'm gonna take a taste for this. Uh, let's see. Look, it has a nice chocolate inside, nice pretzel outside. Let's have a little taste of this bad boy. I gotta say, tastes just like. A chocolate pretzel that you get, like one of those hard ones. Yo, that's that's this taste. It's really good. 
Nice, nice flavor. Please press the subscribe button to the right if you haven't. I'd really appreciate it. And check out my previous videos on the left. Thank you all for watching. This is Matt Reacts. I'll see you all.